This is Reverend Jennifer Hadley, and our power prayer for today is for self-acceptance. Beginning in a field of gratitude, creating that field of gratitude by giving thanks for our ever-expanding awareness giving thanks for the ability to be patient and kind and compassionate, giving thanks that this life in God is eternal, giving thanks that we truly are part of the one, one with the one. We're giving thanks that the one is infinite love, infinite joy, unconditional joy, unprecedented joy, giving thanks that God's nature is wisdom and clarity and peace and harmony, and therefore this is our nature as well. We are grateful and thankful to claim our divinity, to claim the truth living through us and as us. Yes, so we are accepting God as our nature and turning to our higher self, the Holy Self, the Holy Spirit, tuning to the Christ consciousness, the omnipresent presence of divinity as our partner right now. And in this prayer partnership with each other, with the Holy Spirit, with the Christ presence, we are declaring that our prayer is to know true and total self-acceptance now and forever, and to give up any of the ways that we have energized that we were unacceptable at all for anything at any time. Yes, to give that up completely and to give up any memory of it. Oh, yes. We are interested in truly knowing ourselves, knowing our divinity, standing in an awareness of it, head back, shoulders back high-minded, tuned to the presence of God, truly accepting our divinity with every fiber and function of our being, standing in that partnership, that divine partnership, 24-7, and being the place that downloads the kingdom, downloads heaven on earth. Yes, giving up any attachments to separation and to unacceptability in anyone so we're moving into a true acceptance of everyone just as they are giving up all the habits of condemnation and criticism and judgment and separation and standing in a place of true self-acceptance accepting God as it is accepting our life as it is Right now, the life of God, knowing that fundamental truth about ourselves. And then all things are illumined from there. Yes, all things are possible from this vantage point of self-acceptance. No longer rejecting our God self. That's right. We are clear. We're interested in total and true worthiness by means of self-acceptance. Yes, giving up all the ways in which we have energized rejecting ourselves over and over and over again, naming ourselves not good enough or bad or wrong in some way, dysfunctional, giving all of those labels up right now, trading them all for one label, God. Yes, self-acceptance is our prayer today. We're interested in that. And we're not interested in even having a faint memory of all the ways in which we have dissed ourselves in the past. We're distancing ourselves from the dissing. Yes, we are. Oh, my goodness, it's a good day to be in prayer. So grateful for this prayer and the way it unfolds and blesses the life of everyone because we're one with them. Yes, we are united in love and in deep gratitude. We let it be. And so it is. Amen. 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 Ooh, have a blessed day of total, true self-acceptance. At last, at last, free at last. Yes. And I'm going to be doing my healing circle, healing with the Ascended Masters and Archangels, 
on Saturday afternoon in Venice at Urban Remedy. I uh, haven't quite fine-tuned the time, but it will be something like 3 to 5.30 or 3.30 to 5.30, something like that. Many blessings, many blessings, many blessings to you.